Plants synthesize an impressive diversity of specialized metabolites, enabling them to communicate and adapt to environmental challenges. Throughout history, humans have benefited from the medicinal properties of many of these phytochemicals. Specialized plant metabolites and direct derivatives thereof still constitute more than a third of approved pharmaceuticals. Forskolin is a unique structurally complex labdane type diterpenoid used in the treatment of glaucoma and heart failure based on its activity as a cyclic adenosine monophosphate booster. Its commercial production relies exclusively on extraction from its only known natural source, the plant Coleus forscolii, in which forscolin accumulates in the root cork. As the demand for forscolin grows, reliable and sustainable commercial production from Coleus forscolii will become unachievable due to low yields, susceptibility of this species to diseases, changing climactic conditions, and the resource-intensive extraction and purification procedure required to obtain pharmaceutical-grade forscolin. Because its complex chemical structure represents a challenge for classical organic chemical synthesis, elucidation of the biosynthetic pathway to forskolin and subsequent engineering of the pathway to microbial hosts offers a more clear and stable alternative production system that will be better able to address future needs. A pair of diterpene synthase, CFTPS2 and CFTPS3, exclusively present in the root cork, was found to catalyze cyclization of the C20 diterpenoid precursor, geranial geranol diphosphate, into 13R mineral oxide, the diterpene scaffold of forskolin. In our study, we report the discovery of five cytochrome P450s and two acetyltransferases which catalyze a cascade of reactions converting the forskolin precursor, 13R mineral oxide, into forskolin and a diverse array of additional labdane type diterpenoids. A minimal set of three P450s in combination with a single acetyl transferase was identified that catalyzes the conversion of 13R mannyl oxide into forskolin as demonstrated by transient expression in Nicotiana benthamiana. To demonstrate the downstream application of the present work regarding biotechnological production of forskolin, the entire pathway for forskolin production from glucose was reconstituted in the yeast Saccharomyces cerevisiae and afforded forskolin titers of 40 mg per liter. Forskolin is the first example of a pharmaceutical diterpenoid produced entirely in yeast at titers relevant for industrial consideration. The outlined combinatorial biochemistry approach paves the way for development of yeast-engineered platforms for biosynthesis of other known or new-to-nature diterpenoids.